How is it going everybody Mr Android here welcome back to a brand new video on this channel well finally i got the android 12 beta 4 on my pixel 4a the update size was around 320 mb this time google has tried to fix a lot of minor bugs and there has been some cool features added as well with that being said in this video let's check out what are the changes google has made with this beta 4 update also let's aim for 1500 likes on this one so drop a like leave a comment and let's get started Alright guys, first thing first, let me show you a cool thing that has been added with this update which is the Android 12 easter egg. If I go to my settings and then to about phone, now if I tap on this Android 12 version, we have a brand new easter egg for the Android 12. All I need to do is, I need to set the time as 12, you will see this new animation and the background will change based on the wallpaper that you have applied on your phone. I am glad Google has finally added this easter egg which looks great and follows the material you design. Next, let's check out some minor changes that has been made to the user interface. First, if I open my notification panel and tap on the internet, here you can see the Wi-Fi toggle is back. So you can turn on your Wi-Fi connection directly from your notification settings. It was removed in the last beta but they have added it back again with this update. Next, if I press and hold on my home screen and go inside wallpapers and style, here you can see that the themed icons has been labeled as beta. Since we all know themed icons is not fully supported by third party applications, so Google has added this beta tag in front of themed icons. Also depending on the color of your wallpaper, Google icon in the search bar adapts to the same color. I know it's not a big change, but I'm really happy that Google is trying to implement the material you designed throughout the interface. Another cool feature that has been added is the ability to share pictures from the recent apps menu. For example, if there is any picture appears in your recent menu, you will see this icon. Simply tap on it and then you can share it easily to your friends. This feature is super useful and you can even share YouTube thumbnails by using this amazing feature. Next, if I go to settings, notifications, here if I select do not disturb and then go inside schedules, you can see a brand new toggle has been added for game dashboard. Once you enable this option and then while playing games on your phone, you will get a dashboard which lets you to do screen recording and even you can turn on FPS meter as well. For some reasons, it is not working on my Google Pixel 4a. I have tried many games on my phone but still I am not getting this feature. Let's hope Google fix this in the next update. Apart from this, the overall stability has been improved and I can feel scrolling is much better now. Even Google stated that this update is mainly focused on the stability and the performance but still we are able to see some new features added with this update along with the easter egg. Guys I really like the material you design and I just can't wait to try out the stable version of Android 12. I will also be making some comparison videos with Samsung One UI so stay tuned for that. So that's pretty much it guys this was a quick video on Android 12 beta 4. If you guys like this video then be sure to hit that like button. Subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. I am Mr. Android and I will see you guys in the next one.